Holy moly, that's a good jack. Yep. Yep, got him. Oh, oh fuck. Yep, got him. <laughs> Did you see that? Got him. Yep, got one. <laughs> and that's a better one. Yep. Oh. Yep, got him. Look at him. Beautiful fish, eh? Yay. Look at him. Good morning, everyone. It's the last last session for me here, which is a bit sad. I'm going to be fishing for jags again. Um, I'm expecting to fish a low tide, but anyway, I uh, can't complain. Um, we are gonna try the same things I've been trying in the last few days with um, with low flow, which is surface in especially the Ben Mino. It's been working really well. The glide bait was working really well the other day too when they were looking at the Ben Mino and not quite convinced of eating it. But anyway, we'll try with the Ben Mino first. And, um, and maybe, maybe I switch to the glide bait um, later. See if we can get the last couple of jugs of the trip. Let's pepper. Let's pepper all those mangrove roots. Gotta get my casting closer. Yep, there you go. Oh, missed him. <laughs> that was just a little one. There's one there. There's just just little. Definitely a few around. Getting some boils. Just go ahead one to eat. So it was unfortunate, couldn't get couldn't get any of that. Despite getting a couple of boils and hits and whatnot. <clears throat> they were all small anyway. But I only have about 45 minutes left here. Uh, because I want to head back to the other creek where the road opens at 6.30 that's where I've been getting most of the action lately um, so anyway it's always good to come here and fish that from 5 to 6.15 or so um, because a lot of the time I get I get I manage one or two um, it's unfortunate I couldn't fish that running tight again like the first day the first day here was mental they were in fully feeling frenzy um, along that front, front edge um, when I got that 50 centimeter jack that was just insane but anyway again I can't complain this trip has been, been going been going really well so let's pepper all this both edges I can probably go in about 100 meters <clears throat> until it's too deep so anyway let's pepper that and hopefully we get one the other day was very slow we got a little hit there and usually where that dead tree is that's where it gets some of the action not up not up in that tree 
Oh, fuck's sake. My casting is horrible today. That's one of the bad things of Ben Mino. It can be a little bit tricky to cast with accuracy. Just because it does the same funny things up in the air that it does in the water. Action. I got dusted the other day here. You've probably seen in a previous video. It's funny because that tree, when I, a couple of times I went there to recover my lures, it's very shallow. It's, it's only one foot of water. And I got the second second biggest fish of the trip. I got it out of here on the, on a bend minnow. I got dusted at that time. So you know, it holds fish. It's very quiet today. Very, very quiet. looking like it could be the first donut in this in this section let's try to skip that big plastic in so what color I reckon I'm gonna try this one Got him! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Got a little one skip casting. <laughs> good. <laughs> good, good, good. Alright. But well, that's a donut saver here today. You gotta be very lucky to hook them up because there's very little hook exposure in this presentation but as you can see this guy was unlucky enough to get his mouth in into that hook beautiful fish eh? oh nothing major probably just under 30 so obviously not what we're chasing but a jack is a jack Skip casting is it's also cool, so yeah. Hopefully, hopefully we can get another one. That's it. Angry, angry little dog. See you later, buddy. Thanks for playing. That was cool. <laughs> B 
this is by far my favorite skip casting plastic <laughs> it just uh, skips really really well and it it has a beautiful action that tail goes nuts even on a slow retrieve look at it see if we can get another one in the next 10 minutes or so Ooh, oh. <laughs> and then if nothing happens we just head over to the other creek it's just time to head over there that side there is very shallow so I'm just gonna lightly pepper this skip casting and then we'll switch to the swim bait or glide bait whatever you want to call it That's it with the skip casting. <coughs> I'm gonna change to the Gancraft jointed claw 128. <coughs> saw a couple of little ones earlier but hopefully there's also a big one ready to take that glide bait anyway I wouldn't try with a knot so put this on and let's try and get a jack on it Brake settings is probably okay. I went from 8 of the Benmino up to 12 to skip casting. And I'm just gonna leave it on 12 because this is quite heavy. I can't remember the weight, but this thing is quite heavy. And I'm not gonna be casting any, any crazy distance, so. Sometimes it tangles itself up a little bit, but just getting just getting the hang of the casting. Every time you change a lure with such a difference in weight it takes a little bit, or at least it takes me a little bit to get used to and fine-tune your casting the last thing I want is to snug it up I want to get it as close as possible now There's only small ones, you probably won't get any inquiries because this is quite a bit, quite of a big bait, but it's always worth trying. Because remember, I got a 50 centimeter jack out of here, there was obviously a probably a meter more of water but he was sitting under those roots so maybe not a 50 but we could have a 40 now 
and a 40 will eat this glide bait easily because I caught got like a 30 the other day on this one so alrighty I'm in the I'm in the other creek this is the last time I'm gonna be visiting this place I can't believe there's people camping on the other side and they have they have a net all the way across surely that can't be legal can't believe it anyway let's let's head over to the place where I was getting them side casting them the other day there's actually two places this creek's got kind of two branches, left and right. Um, I'm gonna be fishing the left hand side first. Um, I'm gonna start with, uh, with the um, glide bait and, um, and then we'll move to the, to the other side. So uh, let's get into it. See if we can see any jacks chilling on the surface. I'm not sure if that's jacks or not. There's two in there, so. Now let's just mount it. Better concentrate my efforts. Where I think I could get them. <laughs> yep. Oh. Did you see that? Got him! <laughs> Got him this time. Just a little one, but... <laughs> How cool is this? Tiny little fella. But... How cool is this? Another glide bait. Just... Jack. Hungry little fella. <laughs> it's not much bigger than than the actual lure. I'll release him over here. And as you, you could see, it came right off of that drop off. See you later. And he's going back into it. Alrighty, that's cool. Didn't take long to get a jack. Got one, <laughs> and that's a better one. That's a nicer one. <laughs> How cool is this? How bloody cool is this? Still not massive, but. Let's get on the other one. And he's gone. <sighs> Whoa! Yep. Oh. Yep, got him. Got him. <laughs> and that's a better fish. And he's got a mate with him. Holy moly, that's a good jack. That is a massive jack. Oh, that was awesome. That's 
that's what we're after. This is the kind of fish we're after here. Wow. <laughs> what a way to finish the trip. a lot more time to fish and so I'm gonna stick to this lure and this technique it seems to be working and it's awesome it's awesome way to catch catch mangrove jack so hopefully I can get oh, another one or two before I before I call it and I call it for good for the whole trip but look this jack was a good one to end the trip if I don't catch anything else but let's hope I can get another one alrighty I gotta head over to the other side. Yep, got him. <laughs> oh, missed him. <laughs> Lost him. Ah. Alrighty, let's head over to the other um, <coughs> half of the or the other branch of the creek because I've got probably just half an hour fishing left. So let's try and get another one. I reckon I'm gonna put a couple of casts over this side. Yep, oh. Yep, got him. <laughs> got him. <laughs> oh man, and he's another good one. Lift him up like that. There we go. That's another beauty. That is another beauty. Cranky. <laughs> I just want to release you, buddy. Look at him. Look at him. Beautiful fish, eh? Yay. Let's release him over this side. And off he goes. This is the other half of the of the creek. There's a little jack there. I reckon that's a little jack. But I'm just gonna put a cast over there. There's some wasps over there and I got stung the other day. So not really keen on that happening again. Can't see any jacks anyway, so I'm not sure if it's don't think it's worth risking the wasp. Probably just run through it. Quick, 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 quick. So I can fish this part. Jack's chasing it. Only little. He's only little, but look at him. He's looking at it. I don't seem to be here today. Run, 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 run. Okay. 
only got a couple of little windows in between the mangroves here left to fish so we're gonna pepper this and then that'll be it for me in this trip Stop it. <laughs> there we go. Another one. It's no time for photos. He's not huge. But yeah, I think the first one looking at it was bigger. Uh, look, that's Jack number six so i can't really complain at all see you later buddy come on see you later i'm loving this technique I'm not sure if that's gonna work back in Australia, <laughs> but I'm definitely gonna try it. I'm most definitely going to try that in Australia because it's a whole lot of fun. This is super, super slippery. <laughs> yep. Yep, got him. Oh, oh fuck. Alrighty, so this wraps up this episode and the trip all together. Man, I'm gonna miss this place. <laughs> um, it's a bit sad living, but look, I can't complain. It's been awesome. Um, I was expecting good fishing, but I wasn't expecting this. And what a way to wrap it up with six jacks, five of them on this 128 mil. Uh, again craft yeah joint and claw glide bait which is a really cool way to finish um, I really liked this technique on slow water so I might even try might even try this in in Australia might try this around my local creeks and see if that works because man 
it is fun it is good fun oh hang on i think there's a bit of window here let's put another couple of casts Got him! <laughs> oh, <laughs> this. oh, another one gone. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Yep. <laughs> and jack number seven. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> I filmed the outro and I still manage another jack. It's not massive, but. Here's another good jack on on a glide bait, which I can't really complain about that. Jack number seven, right there. Uh, obviously, put another cast in. Man. I know I cast that way. <laughs> Yep. Oh. Ho oh, oh. ho. Big boil. Man, I can't live like that. This is it now. <laughs> Wrapping it up here. And well, thanks for watching. And um, I hope you liked this whole series. Man, I can't wait to come back here. So, alrighty, we'll see you in the next one. Hopefully, uh, a good one too. But that one is going to be in Australia. See you later.